What's going on guys? God bless you. Carlos here with Serrano's Mobile Detail in Dallas, Texas. Thank you so much for being here today and joining me in this pretty fun video, right? If you've been a detailer that's been looking for a camera system um, that's maybe within your budget and maybe you don't have to use wires, this is definitely the video for you. You're currently watching me through the Onwolt wireless camera. How does this camera perform? That's exactly what we're gonna be talking about. Do I like it? Do I not like it? Is the price worth it, right? That is definitely all the key points we're gonna be talking about. So stick around and we'll get started with this video. All right, before we go out there and install this camera, the contents you are going to be receiving in the box is you're going to be, be receiving a uh, the solar panel, which is very, very important. You're also going to be receiving, obviously, uh, the mounting brackets to connect the camera. You're also this is uh, this one here is going to be for your uh, solar panel attachment. And the most important thing, you are going to be getting the camera as well. Uh, so very, very simple looks simple uh, but obviously the main test is going to be how well does it perform so you also get your uh, you also get a manual with that and you also get a nice little sticker that says on 24 hour surveillance um, and in the back really quickly um, this is a 360 so this thing will rotate all the way around which is something i do like uh, is for a camera to give me like really full uh, vision right um, so very very cool and in the back in this port here you also have a sd card attachment that you can uh insert in here and you can also just um pretty much have safe files uh, and in here is also your reset button um on here and your power button as well so uh, that's pretty much what it comes with down here is your charging port before you use it it is recommended that you charge this for 10 hours uh, so it can fully charge and then obviously the rest will be coming from your solar panel all right so the first thing i want to do is find out where usually i get the sun the most and usually it's on this side because uh, i have a tree on the other side so we're going to install the solar panel first right on this side and then you have a nice amount of cord uh, to kind of reach to where you want to set your camera. So the camera, I'm going to kind of set it up in this area here. Uh, once I kind of put this in first, uh, then I'll be able to kind of play on how I want to uh, install uh, the camera. So we're going to install the uh, bracket for the solar panel. And there you go. Now we have a tight fit all the way around. Obviously, if you need to kind of adjust this, then you can. And that should be good. So next thing I'm going to do is I'm probably going to have to go to Walmart and buy some kind of staples because uh, I want this to look professional uh, and I'm going to staple them onto my this piece in here. But for now, we're just going to install the camera and then we will just um, come back and put the finishing touches on it. Let's go ahead and screw one in. And uh, installation was very, very easy, guys. There it goes. Oh, All right, guys. All right, put that on. And next, I'll leave your lever. What? I'll leave your lever. I'm going for a center, right? Um, and All right, now here's it. Okay, and now we have a center. We can go ahead and screw that one. All right, perfect. Now, once you do that, all you have to do is plug it in. Fit here. So it clipped on. Now the only hard part is 
getting these back brackets clipped in. There we go. All right. And we've installed the camera. And I gotta say, having a dog has been probably the best thing that happened to our family. Uh, if you didn't know, we got a Chow Chow. A, uh, he's eight months. And he is my son. And I love him. I love you. I love you, Kojo. I love you. Yeah. All right. Let's begin this product review. Once I've installed this camera, you should be good to go. In this next couple of seconds, you're going to see me walk up to the camera, but you won't see a notification right off the bat. And that is because my settings are a little bit closer uh, to my garage. So that is why you don't see a notification. But as I get closer, you should be able to see uh, obviously my settings. Now it says something has been detected, right? So that is one of the reasons I've actually enjoyed this camera is because it detects um, a movement, uh, even a vehicle could detect that. Um, so that is one thing I have enjoyed. It has that detection, right? Anything that comes into the frame, it will be detected. All right. Another beauty of this camera is you're getting about five megapixels out of this camera. So you're going to be getting a very nice and crisp picture quality. Another benefit of this camera is you're also getting uh, a two-way radio so you can actually communicate uh, with whatever is out here. This camera also has two lights at night if you want to turn it on. You can definitely do that and you have just a little bit of more clear uh, picture as well. It has infrared night vision so at night you'll be able to still see pretty clear how this performs which you'll see a clip as well on how the nighttime vision looks. Aside from this, the price on this camera as of right now, the time of this video is about $99. Let's just say $100, you're gonna get a very solid camera that you can feel very confident that it's gonna do the work. Very quickly to um, activate, uh, very easy to install as you guys saw. And overall, I honestly felt really happy installing it because I didn't have to connect any vid any uh, cables. And that was the beauty of really why I said yes to receiving this camera. Aside, I've been needing to buy a camera to have in the back so I can, when, when I have my customer's vehicles, you know, I have some sort of camera for me to see anything that goes on throughout the night or even through the day when I'm not home, I can see what is going on in my backyard, right? Let's talk about another couple of features that this camera has. Another thing this camera has is you are able um, to record. If you wanna record whatever you're seeing, it is literally recording right now and you can even stop it. And as of right now, you're going to see this camera just kind of tilt and kind of uh, move around. But you have a button right here that you can also move your camera. And that is what gives you the 360 uh, of the um, just vision all around, right? And, and I just love it. Um, so while ever you, if you're not home or whatever and you want to see what is going on, you can literally tilt your camera to right or left and you can even move it up. Just look at the quality though, like the colors, everything is really, really nice. And then you're able to just bring the camera down if you want all the way to the floor. But that is just... A very, very solid, solid picture. Um, the clarity, and that is one thing I do like is you can actually see me through this camera. You can see the vibrant colors that I'm wearing. Um, so for that, it's it's a plus for me. Um, again, the price on this, 
I just can't complain. It is perfect. So if you've been looking for a camera that is very budget friendly, but at the same time, give you some great key benefits. After playing with this camera, I honestly feel like the Onwode is that camera that's gonna give you that peace of mind at a price you can afford, right? Key benefits of it is out of the box, you're gonna get the camera, you get the solar panel to keep the camera charged. Um, it comes with the uh, screws. So all you have to do is really just plug and play. And if you know me personally, you know I'm not good with my hands. Um, so I did like this that all I had to do was just screw in a couple bolts, uh, a couple screws, and we're done, right? And I was able to plug this literally in less than probably 20 minutes. It didn't take me long at all. If I <laughs> could have timed myself, to be honest, I was probably like at 10 minutes. Um, I think the hardest thing for you is kind of placing it or finding where you want to put the camera. Um, but in less than 10 minutes, you can put this camera up and you are good to go, right? You're also getting that kind of 360 view, right? Uh, from left to right. Uh, you're able to move that camera around in case you need to just pan around. You're able to make your camera go up, to look up, to look down. So you have that power to do that as well. As far as connectivity, it connected really well. You just have to download the app. Uh, and it is, this is going to work perfectly with iPhones, with Android. Um, so you can use this with any device, right? Aside from that, you're also getting that nighttime visibility, um, infrared um, or that black and white uh, that you're able to switch if you wish. Um, so at night, it just gives you that clear picture. Uh, motion detection is also a key. As you guys saw on the video, it detects you pretty good. Uh, you're able to play with everything. That way you kind of set it however you want. As you guys saw in my settings, I have everything kind of closer uh, to my garage. Um, that's why it detected me a little bit later, <coughs> but it's at the place where I want detection, right? So you're able to customize um, where you want those things to detect, right? Uh, you're able to disarm it if you want. Um, you're able to um, kind of control everything of, to your liking. Um, and one, thing, one, one key thing is you don't have to have this connected to your Wi-Fi. You can be anywhere in probably the United States probably, um, and go to your camera and you can see what's going on. So for the $99 price range, I'm honestly very happy with the price. Um, again, thank you to Onwell for sending me this camera for me to test out and play with. Um, now I feel a little bit safer to have vehicles over here or even when my kids are playing back here, um, I have some sort of vision on it. Um, so in case anything ever happens, I have cameras to see what is going on and to be honest i might just get another set uh, for the front um, and <coughs> i'll be set um, but overall i'm very happy with the performance of this camera how clear it looks i think for me that was the main thing um, when it comes to cameras usually we get a lot of blurred visions right uh, but i can honestly say that with this it's actually pretty clear uh, which was very surprising to me uh, when I saw the, the price, I was like, mm, I don't know if this is going to be good, but let's give it a try. And to my surprise, it's actually very clear. So again, if you're looking for that camera that is very inexpensive and it's going to give you at least a clear picture, look into the Onwood. I'll be posting a link on the description. Go check it out. I think it's a great tool to have uh, for safety. Um, and at the price, really, you can't go wrong. Christmas is coming as well, so you can probably buy this and give this to one of your family members. You can put this inside, outside if you wish, um, just to give them peace of mind. At $99, I think it's a great uh, camera to have. So, again, thank you so much for watching today's video. As always, God bless you guys, and I'll catch you guys on the next video.